Hey guys, real tough time we're in right now, but we're gonna get through this and I wanna support my good buddy, Phil D'Angelo, round 14. Never put him down. Great clothing line for working out, whatever you wanna do. He's a great man and let's support him. We need to support everybody right now in business. Now, real quick, I just wanna talk about the jab. And the most important thing about the jab, in my mind, is not keeping your head in the middle on the axle on the same jab. So the way we uh, rectify that issue, because what's gonna happen is, if you're throwing that same jab, your head's in the middle, I'm gonna time it with a parry, and boom, come right back with the right hand. So what we need to do is vary the angle of our jab, and that's the angle of our shoulder. So I'm in a good tuck position, here, 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 all right? It's like sword fighting, right? You keep moving, and my feet aren't moving, but my body weight shifts side to side. So I'm gonna go straight, to the left, to the right, down. All right, I'm gonna go to body, head, over, bang. So you wanna vary the angle of that jab and make it difficult for your opponent to tie your jab and to come back with a right hand or a hook over the top, all right? So keep that in mind. If you don't have this ball, you can do it with shadow boxing. Just, again, shake and bake, move that shoulder, and uh, you'll, you'll find you get some good results. All right, guys, this is almost over. We had another week or two of this nonsense, and it's back to life. We'll see you all in the gym. Have a great day.